So here we go. This is what we need. You guys, this is super, super important if you are making anything, I think, because with the rotary board, a rotary board prevents you from cutting. You don't have to cut. So you guys, this is one of the tools that we need. This is one of the tools that you would need for a sewing class. If you decide to take a sewing class with me, you definitely need a rotary board. This one is like 35 inches, I think long, 35 by 23. This is what you need. So this is one. Mm, let me get the rest of my tools. This is two. You guys, definitely a rotary cutter. This is a rotary cutter. This is a 45 millimeter rotary cutter. I was doing a little work today. This is a 45 millimeter rotary cutter. You guys, as you see, I am authentic. Honey, my hair is a mess. I've been in mommy mode all day. Um, I had two classes today. Um, I went to pick up my daughter. Um, so mm, this is how you get it. But the inflammation is going to be good. So that's all that matters. So don't worry about the hair. So anyway, rotary cutter. Board. And the outfit that I'm making. Let me show you guys the outfit that I'm making. So you can kind of get an idea. Um, I actually have to do a how-to video, so I have to make this outfit first. So I'm gonna go through the trial and error part, and um, you guys are gonna go through the trial and error part with me. Hello, before I can make the how-to video. Okay, so here it go. Let me show you what we're making right now. You see it? This is from another designer. This is not my design, but someone wants a pattern to it. So I am in the business of demand. You ask for it, I'll try my hardest to give it to you. So you guys, this is what we're about to make. So let's take this. Look at my dog. Let me show you. Every time I lay anything down, this is what happens. Move, Bruno. Bruno, move. Okay. So we're gonna get down on the ground. Um, what can I make this out of? Mm. Bruno, move. Move, Bruno. Um. Let's do it out of. Oh. Let's do it out of orange. We're gonna do it out of orange. So you guys, um, what I'm using is four-way stretch material only. That's the only material I use whenever it comes to dance wear. Um. This actual pattern that I just showed you guys is, I actually need to see the back of this, honestly. Cause I don't see no arms. So is that a, I think that's a high waist with I wonder why she split the center, though. So, anyway. We can figure it out together. So, I do know the back of the, um, the back of the outfit is booty shorts. So, we have a booty short pattern. We also have a full pattern. So, you guys, this is what I'm starting with. You see? Move, Bruno. Bruno, move. You guys, if you don't know, this is something I teach in my class. Anytime you got fabric, cut off all the extra stuff before you get to laying your material. I mean, laying your fabric down on it. Because if you lay your fabric down on it, I mean, your um, pattern, then 
you can possibly have to later go back and cut your pattern because you done placed it on this little piece. So cut it, cut it off. Okay, so <laughs> this dog, look at this dog, yeah. Bruno, Bruno, Bruno. Keep from under there. Okay, so move, Bruno. Let me work. Move. No, move. Get out from my fabric. Okay. So, oh, let's make it. I go this piece so i think it's this without the without the arms that's what i think it is i think it's that piece without the arms and where's the the booty shorts mm. okay let me get the booty short pattern where am i y'all where the hell is the booty short pattern i should have had everything together sorry y'all i just didn't want to I'm getting the booty short pattern right now. Yeah, I got it. One second. I just want to make sure that's the exact line. Okay, y'all. So, like I told y'all before, I have never made this pattern. So, this is my booty short pattern that I have in the outfit. The back of the outfit looks like this. So, we're going to use this booty short pattern. We're going to use this broke, busted down one piece pattern, you guys, because I've been so lazy. I have not created another one piece pattern. But I have to not, not we get in a tutorial. Yeah, to a degree. It's like a mini tutorial because it's not going to really tell you everything. I'm just telling you the products that I'm using and the things that I'm using. But of course, because this is my business, I do sell how to videos. But I can't make a how to video until no pattern and pan ready. Oh, you're so silly. So I can't make a how-to video until I know how to make the outfit. So I just wanted to come on here with you guys to where y'all could see me make arrows because a lot of people say, oh, you just so good. You know, honey, baby girl, I make arrows all the time. And I don't mind making arrows because that's how I learn. And that's how I'm able to teach you guys. So this is how I make my patterns. So because my... My pattern is busted down and been busted down. Y'all, wait till y'all see what, what's going on with this pattern. So, this is how I copy my patterns. So, if you purchase patterns for me, this is how you get them. So, I put them onto the poster board and, of course, line it up and I cut it out. Oh, I'm not supposed to use this, but uh, if I don't find the other one, I might have to. Also, you guys, if you are cutting patterns, do not use the same rotary cutter that you use for your fabric. The reason why you're going to make your rotary cutter dull. So use a different rotary cutter for cardboard or paper or anything like that. So move, Bruno. Cajun, call Bruno. Bruno. So a lot of y'all repurpose the video as they have to create pattern tutorial okay thank you um so if you don't want to hold your hand down the whole time you can put a can good or you can put anything heavy right here on top of it thank you that was good advice i just didn't want to put a how-to tutorial because i'm not giving the actual full steps i'm only Letting y'all get the full steps right now as I walk through it. Like, as I cut it out and everything. But, 
I'm actually doing it because I have to make, I have to know how to make it first to be able to sell a how-to video. So you can go back and keep using it as much as you need it. So I can't sell a video if I never made the outfit. That's the only reason why I didn't want to do it as a how-to tutorial. Because people will be like, well, you didn't tell us everything. And because my business ain't where I need it to be yet, I'm not in a position to just be able to give up all the free now. Like, everything free. Like, I'm not where I need to be yet. So when I get there, then I'm able to give away a whole bunch more for free. But at the same time, I still got to make a living. Okay, so y'all seen this ratchet pattern. You seen it? This is what I've been doing ever since. Only because I was too lazy to make another one. So I'm looking at I'm looking at the top and the outfit. The girl don't have no, it's no point on the side. So I'm going to have to cut this point out on the side. Because it's no point on the outfit that I'm supposed to be making. So, I'm going to have to cut it off. So, I chopped him off. So, now it's chopped off. So, the center is out, but it's not out too low. So, I'm going to leave some room for the breast area. So, I'm going to go like, probably down some. Because it's only a small little circle. It's not a, a big circle. So I just cut a little circle. So it look a little bit, let me see, a little bit like that. So it looks a little bit like that. And then, like I told y'all before, this is the back. So it's gonna connect right here, I think. I don't know, don't hold me to this. Like I told y'all, I never made this before. But I really think I got it. I think I need the neck a little deeper, but overall, I think I got it. Okay, so now we gotta put it together. To make sure it looks similar to what she wanted. And then I'm gonna ask her, does it work for her? If it works for her, then I'm gonna walk her through how to sew it which this part was easy, just basically showing y'all how I cut the patterns and how I cut my fabric. And you guys, just so you know, these outfits that I'm making, you got this boo, I wouldn't, I would Wow, I, it went away. But you guys, these outfits that I'm making right here, just so y'all won't be like, oh, you're doing it on the floor. Honey, my floor is clean. And these are my display outfits. Just so you know. Okay, so we're not going to do these steps. Y'all can just watch, but I'm not going to talk about the steps because this is what I do in my class. So I hope y'all taking notes, getting the free knowledge. Take notes, take notes. You see how the water rotary cutter is so easy because you don't have to cut anything. You can literally just put it on the board and go off. Like just cut right around it. And like I told y'all, if y'all don't want to hold it at times, just put something heavy down there.
Okay, 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 okay. I don't know what this is. Hey! These kids is ratchet. This is trash. Okay, so here's the top. Here's the front. So now we gotta make the back of the bottoms. So watch me, y'all. Watch me, y'all. Oh, we have 15 minutes. I need to hurry up. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm going. I didn't even pay attention to the time. Okay, so here's the shorts to the back of it. Remember I showed y'all how the shorts was to the back of it? So here's the top. So the only thing we have to do is figure out these little leg pieces. She wants some leg pieces. That's gonna be like the weird part. So let's go up here. Let's move this, put this over here. Oh. We almost done, y'all. I'm almost done. I'm almost done. I'm just cutting some trim. Cutting some trim. Okay. Bing, 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 bing. And let's go to the machine. Okay. So, you guys, I'm using my serger. Let me tilt the machine so you can see it. So I'm using my serger. And now we're gonna serge it. It's gonna be super fast. And then we got everything but the bottom piece. Okay, go to serger. Be nice if it was plugged up. Okay, here's the serger, you guys. It's plugged up, but it's messed up. So, right there. So, I'm a rotor. Needle up. So yeah, if y'all want a tutorial on um, how to thread a serger or how to thread a machine, definitely let me know. I do not mind showing it. Oh, that's a good idea. I think I should definitely do one on how to thread your machine because a lot of people have trouble. And I tell everybody before my class, just make sure y'all know how to thread your machine. Okay. Okay. So this one is an air thread. <laughs> Mainly, it's already. Yes, please. Thank you. I will. I will. I promise. That'll be what I do tomorrow. Okay. So it's done. This one's threaded. This is an air thread. So it all you do is put the you just slide a little in there, and you push it down, and it threads itself. 
Okay, so here go my shorts and here go my top. You guys, let me tell you, this is a no-no. Do not do this. Do not follow what I'm doing. But because this is a test outfit, make sure your thread match. And then make sure the outside of your fabric, like the shiny part, is on the outside. But make sure your thread match. Do not use thread that don't match. Because I used to do that when I was first starting. I used to be like, oh, well, it's selling. Mm-mm. Quality. I was wrong. I was wrong. People used to tell me that all the time. Like, you need to really match your thread. It looked tacky. I'm like, girl, bye. Shit's selling. Can't be that tacky. But no. About to go home? Okay. I got the keys so I can get shotgun. Yeah, no, I'm going to snapple apples. I'll give you one. Will you look in my bag and get a $10 bill out of there? Just give me a couple big snapple apples. Yeah. They, sh they should be like $2. Oh, okay. So look, I seamed this part. Yes, sir. Should be a 10 in there. I seamed this part. And now I'm going to seam this part to this part. Like I told y'all, I never made... It says, you know what? I did make this outfit, but I didn't make it without no arm part. That's what I didn't do. But I made it. But I didn't cut the arm part off. It ain't a 10, just a regular 10 in there, just loose. Should have been a regular 10 in there. Uh uh. So look in the back. So you just might gotta move some books or something. But I just threw it in there. Yeah, Not you really trying to get front seats. Stop. Because I am. No. You still don't see it? No. Shit. <laughs> I really threw it in there. I think he must have got rocks. <laughs> Oh my god, just throw it in there. I owe you 10 anyway. Send me a request for, for $20. Because I owe you 10 anyway. And then just get it for me out of the 10 I give you. Oh, late. Oh, that's another one. That's okay. Yeah, just throw it in there. Just send me a request. Under the hidden agenda. Hidden agenda one. So y'all give me some thumbs up. Do y'all like it? You see how fast we did just do something? Okay, so look, here you go. So boom, bang, boom, bada bang. So look, now all it needs to do is be trimmed. So look, let me show you. Look, boom, bada bang. I don't think I have one. Hidden agenda in the number one. You see it? Boom, bada bang. So now she wants, um, these little leg pieces. This is something I have not never done. The little leg things to connect to it. That's going to be different. So you see it? What do you see the back? So let me show you how the picture again. So it looks like this. You see it? Did I do a little good? Look, you see it? Watch it. Look. You see the back? The back is just like it. The front is just like it. I think. I just think it looks different because it's multicolored. So it's like surged. So if I was to surge this, like cut this part off. And add another piece, it'll look more more to it. Now I just gotta figure out these little leg things. I can't wait for my pattern. Yay! So y'all, just like I told y'all before, I'll try my hardest to make whatever pattern. If I can't make it, I'm gonna tell you I can't make it. I'll be like, look girl, I cannot make this. Like this is one that ain't gonna work. But if it is a pattern that you see, that you like, I'll try my hardest to make it. 
And then if I can't make it, it's gonna make me mad. So I'm gonna keep on trying it until I get it. So let's put this little thing on a mannequin because I don't want to take up all your time. I appreciate the 25 minutes that y'all have been on here or if y'all just logged on, I appreciate that. Please, please, please give me thumbs up if you like it, if it was helpful, if you got a little, a little something. Even if it was a little something, it was free. So look, you see it? Oh, shit. Entire three. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. So look, you see it? This mannequin ain't got no cakes. You see it? So either way, thank you. So look, you see it? Let me show y'all again. No, we just got to make the leg pieces. But here's the back. Here go her cakes. But she don't got no cakes. So all I would have to do is trim it. Yes, it trimming will be super, super fast. Do y'all want me to trim it or y'all don't want me to trim it? Is that enough information? Or would y'all like to see me trim it? You just let me know. Because if so, I got to run right here in the garage and get some orange thread. If you want to see the finished product, give me thumbs up. Give me thumbs up if you want to see the finished product. Okay, so now that we're trimming, you guys, why do I still only got three thumbs up and it's four people in the room? Thumbs up are free. We should not be this excited on a Friday night for someone. Yes, because we getting that money, girl. This is money. People look at it like it's just sewing. Y'all, I'm still missing a thumbs up. It is four people in the room and three thumbs. That's it. Y'all can't like the video? That's what I meant, the like. That's why I got the keys. Okay, here we go. Bing, bang, 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 bang. Here we go right here. Okay. Here we go. So you guys, with this machine, I have to trim the extra hustle. Yes, girl, money. So look, I have to trim with this material. My serger is just to seam my, my areas. Put Bruno up before y'all let him out. Oh, he's right there, I'm gonna smoke him up. Okay, so here we go. So, I don't know if y'all know, but of course you need bobbin. Make sure your thread matches your material. You see how close it is? So we get rid of it real fast. This 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 trim should have been the same. Let's get the likes up, folks. Come on, y'all. It's free knowledge. We can get the likes up. Y'all see why people don't like giving away nothing free? Okay, but that's why people don't like giving away free stuff because people won't even do something that costs them absolutely nothing. But to learn, like they'll learn all day. They'll take notes, they'll apply it to their life and won't even just give you a thumbs up. Ain't that crazy? But let me tell y'all something. Karma, when it comes time for you to have your business, and you try to do the same thing, you're going to get back the same energy you put out. I hope you know that. I don't know if you knew that, but the same energy you're going to get. 
Okay, so. And once again, I'm going to do the um, how to thread your machine video tomorrow. So don't forget, cut your notifications on so you won't miss it whenever I do post it. Okay, so here we go. We're about to trim it. It won't take. There we go. Thank y'all. I truly appreciate it. So y'all, here we go. Take notes. Look at it. Screen record. Do whatever you need. Because this class, I do charge for a trim class. So you're getting it free right here just looking at it. Thank y'all so much for the thumbs up. So I'm going to start from the back area. And I stitch on zigzag. Only zigzag. The only time I stitch on um, straight stitch is if I'm locking something. So if I'm not locking nothing, then I won't stitch on zigzag. But are y'all watching? You get what? I didn't hear what you said. You said absolutely. Do you get what? Oh, and I did this wrong, y'all. When y'all do, when y'all get ready to trim, make sure make sure y'all trim length is the same length of whatever you about to trim. Like right now, this is not the same way. So I'm going to have to add trim to it. And sometimes people don't know how to add trim on top of trim once they start. So thank y'all again for the likes. I really appreciate it. Thank you. And y'all, please comment below if it's something that y'all want to see. Like I told y'all, I'm not really, really good at creating content like knowing exactly what y'all need but I do want to be able to give you exactly what you need so if you tell me it's a lot more helpful than me guessing and trying to figure it out because it's a lot of people in the world that I'm trying to reach so it's no way that I'm going to be able to to know what everybody exactly needs because everybody don't need the same thing so if you tell me I'll try my hardest if I can do it. The only thing I can't do, honey, y'all would not learn how to measure from me because I cannot measure. I eyeball everything, and I like it that way. I don't want to learn how to measure. I just want to keep doing it the way that works for me, and I think it's less stressful for me. I think I got ADHD and something, or I got something. I just can't. I can't, I can't sit and do that. I think I got anxiety. I don't know what's it called, but... I don't like measuring. It give me a headache. Then I'll be stressed out. Then I'll put it down. I won't get back to it. So, y'all, yeah, I'll show y'all yeah, how to make money without measuring. And make money without using pens. Nothing's wrong with pens. Nothing's wrong with measuring. Don't think I'm downplaying anybody. But when you use four-way stretch, it'll stretch to a little person. It'll stretch to a big person. It does not matter. And then with the patterns, all you do is go out more. If it's a tiny, if go go out more. If it's a bigger person, go in more. If it's a smaller person. But you don't have to know how to measure just to make clothes. That's some bullshit. Don't let nobody tell you that. Start, start. I'm telling you, don't let nobody tell you, oh, you got to know how to measure. That's what people told me all the time. You got to know how to measure. How you going to teach somebody how to do something and you don't even know how to measure? Well, guess what, bitch? I've been getting paid teaching and I've been helping people grow and learn without knowing how to fucking measure. And they actually love it that way because they don't like measuring anyway. Uh -huh. I know you watching too. Thank you. But a lot of people don't like that pressure. A lot of people don't like that pressure. It's it's a lot of work measuring. For me, I don't even measure the pictures on my wall, honey. They'll be crooked 10 times to avoid me from getting a tape measure and going through all of that. I'll stand back and look at how they look and adjust them. 
<laughs> and then whenever you're selling exotic wear, all you got to do is label it as one size fit most. That's what other people do anyway. It's working. Why, why try to create the wheel? Like, don't recreate it. It's already working. Because it's your gift to share as you, under, as you understand for people who don't have the patience and motivation to see. Thank you. I don't know why this keeps doing this. I really don't know why it's keep doing this. Oh, shit. Let me pay my cash out. I'm sorry, y'all. One second. I was supposed to pay this cash out. Oh, shit. He's going to kill me. Nathan, pay. I'm trying to get some Snapple apples and shit, and I'm getting ready to forget. Okay, so look. We almost done, y'all. We almost done. I promise. I promise we almost done. Let me get y'all off here. Because I know y'all tired. I know y'all like, bitch, uh, are you going to finish the outfit? You're telling. And work speaks for itself. Thank you, baby. Thank you so much, Nikki. I really appreciate it. I really, really appreciate it. Y'all have no idea. So, y'all, I'm thinking about doing a podcast. I'm not going to tell y'all the name of it. But I'm telling y'all it's going to be juicy. <laughs> It's going to be juicy. I was trying to do a, a OnlyFans page to get like um, memberships and subscriptions to where you can get a lot of free stuff if you just pay one um, one time with OnlyFans. But I ain't figured out OnlyFans. Like I ain't figured that out yet. But I do have one. Keep us posted. Oh no, I am. I promise I am. Y'all, I've been thinking about it all day. I was attending a, a virtual conference and it came to my mind. I was like, oh, bet. Because I got so much response on my personal Instagram. I mean, my personal YouTube. And it was a lot of similar content to that. So I'm really thinking about, thank you, I'm loving this. Thank you. Um... I was thinking about, since I got a great feedback on it, I was thinking about just doing a podcast. I'm like, why not? Shit, everybody else is doing it. I ain't never did it, but I'll figure it out as I go. What they say, you don't got to be great to get started, but you got to start to be great. Almost done, y'all. Almost done. Go over these couple of parts. Y'all, I'm telling y'all, the podcast, the title, the title is going to be so catchy. It's going to be, it's going to be a topic itself. Everybody going to want to talk. Everybody going to be like, what? That's so, shut up, shut up. Because you know how everybody judge everything. Okay, so I'm just going to do this other side. And then the back, and then we don't. So look, make sure your piece lines up. Make sure your piece is the length of whatever you're doing. Like, don't just do what I just did. Because I was trying to talk and do this at the same time. Don't do that. Because then you'd be mad. If you don't know how to add the extra trim, if you go if it's short. Y'all, these are secrets right here. Y'all see what I'm doing? I know y'all be like, how does that happen? How do you do? You see it right here.
Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's cut off all our strings. Y'all make sure y'all cut off all y'all strings. So y'all won't have a little tacky little outfit. Yeah, I remember this girl that used to work with me when I used to work in Myrtle Beach. When I tell you she used to sell outfits, she made so much money. But let me tell you the only thing about her outfits. You had to make sure you brought scissors with you to work because all the strings was always hanging. But they were so cheap and affordable. Shit, I didn't even care about the strings. I was like, let me get that. $35? $40? Okay, so look. Y'all see it? So we done did the outline. Yeah, we did the outline. So now all I got to do is do the little circle real fast. Let me just do the circle real fast. And then I'll put it on the mannequin. And then y'all can see it. And then we'll be done. So I know a lot of people always ask me, how you do a circle? How do you do a circle? If y'all know somebody, they'd be like, how you do a circle? Just send them the damn video. Be like, girl, this is how you do a circle. Now make sure you buy me lunch for showing you how to do a circle. Oh, thank you. Girl, I just grabbed the material. I couldn't even think, wonder how many fools passed this up. Oh, well. <laughs> I know, I'm getting ready to have to refund um, the girl that just paid me for the how-to video. I'm going to refund her. I'm going to still give her I'm gonna still give her the patterns, all three of the patterns that go to it. But um, I'm going to have to refund her the remaining because she can just use this video. Unless she want me to actually tell her everything that I'm physically doing, like with the trim and everything. And then tell her how to cut it and, you know, all of that. So, if, you, if you're listening, honey, I'm definitely going to refund you. Unless you want me to walk you through the steps. I know it's kind of hard. Um, like, some people don't learn like this. Like, just watching somebody and then other people do learn like this. So, if you are watching, I'm so sorry. If you are watching Love and you still want it. Then I'll walk you through by saying all the steps. But if you feel like you can get it just like this, then I don't have to do your video. I'll just refund you the remaining and just send you your patterns. But if you still want me to talk and actually show you what I'm doing and tell you the little secrets that I'm running through real fast, just seeing if you catch it. Everybody, everybody just need to catch it. Because I can't explain it because this is how I make my money. So I can explain it to you if you're booking a class. But if you're not booking a class, the way that you're going to have to learn it is watching. I don't personally do tutorials. Only because I just stopped dancing. And this is how I feed my kids. So... I still got to make money. But I do give a lot of free knowledge away, though. I do. But with the classes, you guys, I do fully explain everything. I do not just speed through it like this. I don't just rush through it. I explain everything. And if you do experience an error while you're trying to try it out, you can call me because at any time. And um, you can call me at any time and I'll help you through it. Let me see. Wait a minute, y'all. I'm sorry. Here, tell him um, I'm doing a live real fast. Live. Yeah, I'm making an outfit on live. Just give me one second. Yeah, one second. Okay. Ask him how his head feel. How your head feel, bro? Mm. Love you good. I want to support so you ain't got to refund me anything. No, I'm just going to... Then I'm going to send you an extra pattern or something. And then I can still, if you still want me to tell you the steps, I still can do the how-to video tomorrow. Well, not tomorrow, 
Because tomorrow's my daughter's birthday. I forgot earlier when I told you tomorrow. But tomorrow's my daughter's birthday. So I can send you the how-to video with the full steps. Um, with all the patterns on Sunday. I can mail it out at the kiosk. Because the kiosk be open 24 hours. And I'll still do your how-to video. I just wanted you to see that I told you I was going to do it. So I was going to try to figure it out right now. Yeah. Watch out. You got to knock off my thing. Sorry. Okay. Okay, yeah. Just one more. One more little leg. Here's a little leg piece. And then we're done. I can put it on the mannequin. And then all I have to do is figure out her little leg part. Which will be easy. But I'm not going to figure it out right now. Um, You guys, if you do want to see the finished product with the leg piece um i'll post it on my instagram my instagram is hidden agenda brand so i'll post a picture of it with the little leg piece soon as i figure out how to make the little leg piece i think i know how to make it but i think i gotta actually cut a full pair of shorts attach them together and then once i attach them together then cut that little bottom piece out. That's what I'm thinking I have to do. I don't know why my thing keep... Oh, this keep coming out. That's why. Sorry. Sorry. So, y'all, come on. Tell me where y'all from. Everybody, tell me where y'all from in the chat. Where you from? How long you been following me? How did you find me? All that good stuff. How can I assist you? How can I help you? What is it that I have that you need? How can I serve you? All of that good stuff. Whenever you got time, love, this video is good. Okay. I would've got more, but I bought it now. Thank you. Uh, I'll put Aspen, food. North Carolina, raised in West Palm Beach. You gonna put two okay. Shoes? Yeah. I'm from Kentucky, you guys. Okay, here we go. We're done with that bottom. Cincinnati, Ohio. Okay, okay. You right near Kentucky. Oh, I'm on live. I'm sorry, y'all. I'm on YouTube live. Huh? It's okay, girl. It's all right. They know I'm a mommy. I got kids and extra kids. Okay. Okay, so here's the bottom part. We just got your creative. If you could bottle that up. Oh, don't worry. Courses. They're coming. Courses. They're going to be off teachable. Browse County, a friend sent me a page and I fell in love. Oh, yeah. Courses. The courses are going to be able to um, be bottled up. So the courses, you're going to have access to the courses to where you can use it as much as you need. It. I needed something to drink. Sorry, y'all. Ooh. Okay. This is one little piece, and let's get the mannequin and put it on the mannequin. Where you at, mannequin? So, have anybody here already took my class? Have any of y'all already took my class? If so, how did you like it? This is the last piece, y'all. I promise. I know I said that before. But look. This is the last little leg. Look, this is the last piece. That's it. Everything else is trimmed. Have any of y'all um, already took my class?
They better catch that two hundred dollar special before. Oh, facts. I try to let just join not long ago. I'm glad I did. Yay! Um, I try to let my first year. My first year is gonna be two hundred, and then the price goes up. So I just started in January. I just started doing classes in January. So in January, the price goes up. And then how many sewing classes give you free patterns? They make you pay. You paying for anything. Okay. That's it. Let's put him right here. Not yet, love. Well, you guys, I do have a lot of people. I do have a lot of video reviews on... On my Instagram, if you go to my Instagram and look under virtual classes or in-person classes, you will see you will see a lot of people. Some people never sewn a day in their life. Some people never even touched a sewing machine. And you see them making outfits. Okay, here we go. We're done. Okay. Cut this other little string. Okay, let's go. Okay, so here's the outfit. Where's the mannequin? I can't wait to get my she shed, y'all. Get my she shed next month. So y'all gonna be in my little cave with me. It's gonna be lit then. Cause we gonna have live sales. Here we go. So, with this mannequin, because this mannequin don't got no cakes. But this is how it turned out. Of course, if the mannequin had cakes, you can see the way it will hug. You see how it will hug? But the mannequin ain't got no body. Now, the way that, um, Nikki, the way that the outfit was that you sent me, it was considered surge. So what y'all, if y'all decide that y'all want to surge something, what you do before you trim it, you cut the pieces out. You take that piece and you put it on top of the material that you want to replace right here. So it will be just like a puzzle. So let's say I wanted this pink, just only this part. I'll cut right here. I'll cut this whole top off. I'll put it on a pink fat on a pink fabric. I'll trace it and I'll piece it back right here and stitch it. So then this will be pink, this will be orange. So on the picture that you sent me, Nikki, it was different one, so it looked a little different because it's not that exact one. But it's similar to it. The only thing we gotta do is get the little leg pieces. I would, I would crystal this out. It's plain. Like, I could sell it like this, but to me, it's plain and I'm, I'm an extra person. What I can do is I can crystal around the, uh, around the lining and then sell it for like $65 if I crystal it out. But if I go in on it, like, I can add some chain right here, baby. Right here to right here. I can let the chain drip. I can do a piece of chain from right here to right here. I can add a little patch in it. Like, let me show you. I can do like a designer. I can do like a designer patch and just like sit it in the center or sit it right here and add the value on it. Like, let's say I can do a Gucci, Louis, whatever, or me. I've been on my hidden agenda shit. So, um, we can put a hidden agenda right here bling it out around it and then you be good to go and then you raise the value the value and in, in the way to increase your value is with crystals with designer names with chain with 
anything that you add to it, you raise your value up. So, before we go, you guys, I do want to show y'all this. Got it, piece by piece. Okay, so listen, let me show y'all something before we go. If y'all do want y'all own brand on the elastic or on the fabric, I have the vendors for them. If you do not want to purchase the vendor, my vendors are $350. If you don't want to purchase the vendor, you can get it. You can get 30 yards for $175 and I'll order it from my vendor for you. So you customize it. You make whatever you want it to say for um, $175 and I give you 30 yards of your own, your own stuff. Y'all. Yeah. So I'm not trying to be the only person out here like with my stuff branded because now my fabric is in route. So now I'm getting ready to have my full waist stretch hidden agenda fabric. And baby, I'm going to come through like Louie and Gucci too. They ain't the only ones. That's dead. So y'all, I hope y'all really enjoyed the video. I hope it was useful. I hope, um, I hope y'all really got some value out of it. If you did, please comment below. Please um, give it a thumbs up. I love that different patterns can make different. Yes, honey. Trust me. Oh, before I go, I got three minutes. Listen, if you get tired of sewing, let me tell you the good part about this. When you buy a vendor, one, you got the vendor forever. So you can resell that vendor a million times till you die. You can pass it down. You can write down the information, give it to your kids, Give the targeted audience to your kids and say, listen, this is how you make money. You have a value, you have valuable information that people are going to forever need. Someone ain't going nowhere. Someone was here before I got here. Someone's going to be here after I leave here. So when I die, my kids are going to be able to make money off all the knowledge that I had. Why? Because it's knowledge. It's valuable. That's how we live. So with this vendor... You can then, everybody in your surrounding area, or everybody anywhere, your target audience, you can take orders and get them custom elastic and make money off of that. Create a whole outfit helpful, of course. Thank you. Um, you can sell it. You can sell this elastic. You can get any designer you want on it. You can sell it for $13 a yard. I sell elastic for $13 a yard. So that's creating another income stream. So now if I don't feel like sewing, I can just make money out selling elastic. And if I don't feel like selling elastic, I can sell the vendor and make money out selling the vendor repeated over and over and over again. It's the same thing with the fabric, uh, um, the fabric vendor. It's the same thing with the crystal vendor. Any vendors you buy, don't look at it like, oh, I'm wasting my money. Oh, I'm not getting ready to pay that much for no vendor. Who they think they are? Honey, listen, knowledge is power. The vendors is the best thing I ever purchased in my life. The best thing. Why? I have made so much money off vendors. And if you have purchased vendors from me, you know I'm not lying. And when you buy a vendor from me, I will give you strategies on how to make money off those vendors if you need them. So I say that to say, you guys, we almost at an hour. I love y'all. Thank y'all for um, subscribing to my channel. Thanks for liking my video. Thanks for, you know, just all the support. I truly, truly appreciate it. And I really hope this was valuable. Until tomorrow.